Tolman Institute of Technology is celebrating a major victory. The school's Kemi car team placed high in a worldwide competition. Storm Team 10's Brady Harp spoke to the team. Students at Rose Holman say they've been working for weeks to complete a car to compete against teams from around the world. They say this is the first year they've made it to the championships. On your mark, get set, go. Rose Holman Institute of Technology's Kimmy Car team is celebrating a fourth place finish against teams from around the world. Team leader Noah Eckstein says the team has been working for weeks on the car. What Kimmy Car is, is we build a car powered entirely by chemicals. You can't have the traditional mechanical brakes or an internal combustion engine like you have in a car. It's all uh, a reaction that takes place on the car. We generate our own power. Team members say the competition is designed around the car being able to carry an unknown load. The approximately shoebox sized car that was powered off a chemical reaction to go a specified distance. Um, it doesn't matter if you go over or under, but how close you can get to that specified distance. The car was designed and built by several students. The students have affectionately named it the Great Gatsby. While the car may not look like a typical automobile, it is powered entirely by a chemical reaction the students have designed around. It goes through uh, a 0.5 horsepower air vane motor that sends it down to these wheels and uh, pushes it down the track. Team leader Eckstein says he has put a lot of his time into the project and says it has helped him learn hard lessons he will use for his career. I've learned that if you get a problem that you don't think you can solve, just, just go for it. The team says they will take what they've learned this year and continue to improve their designs. They are hoping to make nationals for the second time next year.